I put this project together to give you guys some practice at building a complete website. In this project here, we're going to be using GSAP as well as Animate on Scroll as far as animation libraries. When you first come onto the site, we're going to use GSAP. There'll be an overlay that arises up revealing the home hero. We're going to have our navigation where if you, when you click on menu, it's going to slide over into this space here. The links are going to stagger in. Once they get to the bottom, the word menu is going to morph into close and then it'll do the opposite. That morphs to close. When you click on it, it goes back. We're using GSAP for that. The next section, as you scroll down, it's going to fade in using Animate on Scroll. The sections will fade in. And I'm trying to use features that bars and restaurants use. So first thing you're greeted right up front is the locale and the hours. As you come down, again, this is a bar. I'm going to use GSAP on a, on a reveal feature for their daily happy hour specials. So when you click on that, those will stagger in an image with the name, the description, and a price. And that will be pulling in from Contentful. We'll host, I'll show you how to host all your assets and data that you're passing as props up on Contentful and Quorum from Contentful. Next, we have a video, which a lot of restaurants and bars ask you to put in on their website. And on this, I'm going to show you how to use a great service called Wistia, which is faster than YouTube or Vimo and is free for most websites I've ever built. And as soon as you click on it, especially on mobile, it go, it starts right up. There's, you don't see any loader, none of that shit. Then as you scroll down, instead of having an about page, I just put a little, our story section directions, where when you click on it, it just goes, it's already preloaded on Google maps. They can get the directions. When you click back, you come back here, of course, just a small, simple little footer at the bottom. And as you open it here, when you go to drinks, I have a page, obviously it's a bar, so we got a page for cocktails. I just put in some images, some descriptions, and I'm using, well, we're gonna be using Animate on Scroll to reveal each section. Those sections could be anything. I just named them by types of alcohol. And then again, this one's Animate on Scroll. Then I did a, they always want a calendar and events. Normally they want it on their homepage. I decided to put it in its own page. And you scroll down, these are just components, reusable components, again, that we're going to be querying out of Contentful. And then down here, a slider, which is about every restaurant and bar wants, or a gallery. Here, I went with a slider. It's simple. We're going to use Slick for that. And then, just to round it off, a contact page that works. Just a real simple contact page. Not a whole heck of a lot of work into this. I'm, I think I'm going to add some animation to it, but for now, when you click it, it just heads over to Form Spree. When you click on that, you get the email in your email address that you provide inside the code. So that works. So here it is. It's a simple website. It's not the most in-depth website, but it, you will get a lot of practice on using certain microservices like Contentful and Wistia and also putting up your Git repository and how to post on Netlify straight from your uh, GitHub repository. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you get a lot out of it. Leave me uh, some comments if there's something you want me to change. Or anything like that. The next video is going to be on setting up the environment. So if you already have Node on your computer, so you do have starter files, and I'm going to link that in the description on all the videos. But you do, you're going to have to have Node.js installed on your machine. And if you want to use VS Code to code along exactly the way I'm doing it, you'd want to download VS Code. And also, you want the Gatsby CLI on your machine. But I will put up a video that shows you how to put that up. All right, enjoy, guys.